Hey, this is Rodney. I'm out here in front of my uh, my friend's fence place. You know, we're gonna do these uh, training videos for you. We're here at his shop. I'm gonna go inside, introduce you to him, just give you a little preview of what you have to look forward to in your free wood turning videos here at freewoodturningvideos.com. Let's go in and check him out. What's up, Sven? Where are you? Oh, there he is. What's up? Hey, what's up, Rodney? How I, you doing? Good, man. How are you? I'm, you know, everybody's excited to hear about your videos and see your videos. I told them you were the best wood turner and uh, showed them some of your work, and they're pretty impressed. So, why don't you give them an idea of what, uh, yeah. what you want to yeah. show them your shop, man? Yeah. I love your shop. Hey, guys. Well, welcome to my shop. This is uh, where I'm a custom cabinet uh, builder by trade. And uh, wood turning is my passion, though. That's what I like the best. So, that's what I'm going to show you guys. I was just over here before Rodney came. I, I cut some blocks. That's black locust and uh, some ash. Uh, I have a turning school here, so I just get some green wood for the students. So let me tell you what. Let me show you a wrap. Come on up. Um, like I said, this is where the cabinet portion is. And upstairs is where all the good stuff is at. Right. Yeah. I want, I want you to show people that, that, that cool shoot you made too that uh, puts all your dust downstairs. <laughs> oh, yeah. Anyway, guys, this is where I do my stuff right here. Uh, Roddy, why don't you show them exactly what we got right here? We have a Power Matic, we have a One Way, we have a couple jets and a Laguna. So, come on in. Reminds me of Woodshop, man, so many years ago. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know what? Let me show you some of the woods I do too. Um, we have a lot of different exotic woods. I got some beautiful cherry wood right here, cherry burl from Carolina. I got some buckeye burl right here from California. These are Australian burls. That's called gimlet. And uh, I have some York gum over here. We got some jar of burl, uh, salmon gum burl. We got all kinds of different burls here right now. Cool. So. Anyways, now, now so, I'm not a wood turner, but I, I imagine all that, all those different pieces of wood give you different effects and different colors and things. Is that it? Oh, oh, definitely. The color. Everyone that's a wood turner knows the difference on like uh, the grain on Australian or, or the burr wood. It's, it's so random. It's beautiful. And uh, see, I'll tell you what, guys. Even I am not a vivid, you know. I can make mistakes too. See, <laughs> but I was trying to get it really, really thin. And uh, there she went, so that's okay. But that, uh, that's what you're going to show people though, right? How, oh, how to get gonna, it really oh, thin? Yeah, we're going to show them how to turn a, a hollow form. I have some right here that I haven't finished. Um, I got a couple right here that uh, I need to work on too. These are just sitting here right now. Um, this was one that was done by a student of mine. Never turned a hollow form in his life and walked away with this little one. It, uh, it is uh, an alder. Uh, material Ooh. so yeah he did a pretty good job on it so anyways when we start shooting what I'm gonna do though is uh, I'm gonna take you on um, how I do things step by step uh, what we'll end up doing is uh, prepping the wood putting uh, putting the wood between centers rounding it and then we're gonna cut a tendon on the back side so that we can chuck it and then once we chuck it we'll fine-tune the outside We'll drill a pilot hole and uh, that'll give us our depth and then uh, we have various hauling tools. I have pretty much all the different hauling tools available from John Jordan, Mike Joukowsky, Kelton, Sorby, Derry, um, pretty these, much any of them. But Are well, these them over here? Right here? Uh, yeah, yeah, you can see uh, some of the tools right there. Um, this is a full set of Joukowsky, they got hunter tips on them. Uh, we got a John Jordan set right here. Uh, we got a Sorby up here. Um, Kelton's and uh, Jamison's are all, you know, put away right now. Um, but I'll tell you what, you guys are going to be amazed with this little tool right here. This one was manufactured by Don Derry. Um, you guys are going to love it. This is what I'm going to show you uh, how to do holoforms with. Um, it's just the ease of operation and everything about it is, is makes life a lot easier easier for us wood turners. So cool. Yeah. So, but anyways, this is uh, pretty much where I do business, and uh, 
and I spent a lot of time up here. Um, it's really comfortable up here. We got AC, we got dust collection here, uh, two grinders, a man saw, we got a homemade kiln. Um, anyways, um, I'll tell you what, let's go downstairs and I'll show you uh, some of the stuff that you guys are going to end up doing when you uh, watch some of the videos that I'm going to show you. Now, this is my office. Excuse the mess. It's not always like this, but I've been really busy lately. But, uh, for instance, uh, Rodney here. I'm sure you might have seen this on the website. We got us a nice piece that's been pierced. This is uh, North Fork Island Pine. Now you can see exactly how the work was done on that. Pretty wild, huh? Um, lately, I've been doing a couple different things. I'm getting into uh, uh, pyrography. So I've been doing some work on uh, with pyrography with a burning pen. Wow, that's cool. Yeah, that's uh, that's a piece of sycamore. So you're drawing all of that on there, huh? With a with a yeah, I'm free, burning it. free handed with a pencil and then uh, call, you know following my pencil lines with the wood burning. Wow, you got kind of an underwater theme. Yeah, that one's some mermaids. My wife likes mermaids. My wife likes butterflies. Does your wife yeah. ever get to see you with all the time you spend over here at the shop? No, no, <laughs> no. Only at night. But see, that's the ticket about wood burning. You could do it at home when you're with your wife. That's okay. That's what's really nice about it. So you've combined the wood wood turning. I mean, the wood turning with this wood burning. Yeah, it's just a it's just a new uh, a new phase. All of us wood turners go through different phases. You know, a lot of these are burls. Um, that I was into doing burls from like a beautiful manzanita burl. Wow, look at the, look at the, the shine on that. Yeah, that's Great manzanita. Finish. And then we have us uh, Australian gimlet burl, hollow form. Nice. Yeah, and then I was into a segmenting phase, so I took Australian burl. Whoops. Uh -oh. I knew that was going to happen. That's all right. Uh, that's all right. <coughs> yeah. Um, Oh, you can edit that. And then uh, <laughs> this is actually an Australian segment and burl. Okay. So, oh wow. Okay. See that pattern yeah. there. I got one else. Yeah. In fact, one of our one of our uh, subscribers he asked he had some specific questions about segmenting. So you know maybe when you know you have those tapes we can address some of those issues. Yeah. But what we're gonna do right now, guys, is um, I'm gonna go through the uh, ten minutes until a uh, ten minute YouTube videos until. You get an idea of what I do. I'm going to run through it fairly fast. Uh, our goal, Rodney and me, right now is to show you guys to get you started. And uh, probably in about a month or now, we're going to shoot a real nice instruction video for you. Oh, sooner than that, baby. Yeah. Sooner than that. In depth. Oh, you know, yeah. See, a lot of times when we do these YouTubes, it's going to be hard to, to go over the way I hold gouges, how to sharpen gouges, um, and uh, the cutting and the grain patterns. and. Uh, there's going to be a lot more depth in the instruction video than it is in the YouTube uh, due to time frames. Yeah, so. so they'll be able to do this stuff that you're showing us here today, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't think uh, anybody that's been a wood turner for eh, any length of time is totally going to understand what I'm, what I'm talking about. And uh, I just hope that it gives you a couple extra tips to uh, make hollowing easier for you. Cool. Yeah. So. All right. Well, we're at 8.48 on time now, but... Uh, uh, I'm looking forward to it, Sven. We're gonna we're gonna hopefully help a lot of people out there. A lot of wood turners are looking for a lot of uh, tips and tricks that you've been able to uh, learn yourself. And you've only been turning for two years, right? No, no, I've been. It's been about a little over three years. Three now. years? Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, it's been about three years. So. Yeah. All right. Well, I, you, you've gotten really good at it. I mean, from from all the work you see. You well, get a lot of I have a lot of uh, uh, available time, being that my studio's right here at the wood shop. There's a lot of downtime sometimes when I'm waiting for doors or the paint to dry or whatever it may be. So where are you gonna find me when there's uh, downtime? Upstairs turning. Right, all right, yeah. cool. Anything? All right, guys, looking forward to uh, shooting this video and uh, we'll be seeing you soon. All right.